Hmm. Okay, good evening. Yeah. No. Okay. Hello, how are you? Hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How's it going? How you doing? So far, so good. Awesome. Okay, today is what? Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday September 22nd. And Claudia Maricela Solano Crispin is not with us anymore. Okay. Hmm. A fire escape plan. Today we have to talk about a fire escape plan. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what have you been up to? What have you been up to lately? Come on guys, you, you shall start the class. Hi guys. Hello. Hi, Stella. I'm I'm buying with the with the bitcoins. <laughs> I'm on the supermarket. And you're using your thirty dollars. That's good. <laughs> yeah, actually, actually, you you don't need to to go to the ATM. All right. You, yeah, you can ask to someone that that. ¿Cómo se dice de confianza? Someone you trust. Person. Trusty person or uh -huh. family member, mm -hmm. so you trust, yeah, uh, to transfer to transfer to you the the bitcoins um, to re to receive in, in dollars, and then you can add a bank account in in your in your um your account. wallet, yeah, and then you can transfer the the funds to that bank account. Awesome. So I got I got around sixty dollars. I know I, I heard that. Hey, you know what? It's finally available for my cell phone. I can't believe it. Yeah. So what's the pro what is the process? Once you download the app, what do you do? Register. You have to register it. Yeah, you have to register. Whoa. You have to you have to take a picture of, of your do we? Mm -hmm. And then you have to take a picture that for. Sorry. Um, recognize. No, yeah, recognize face. Your face. Your face. Okay. Okay. Someone's gonna be very happy. Do Do you see an image where? Where it says, um, uh, "Sorry, you cannot register since your wife already get registered your your ID number." No, I don't see that. <laughs> if I see it, I'm gonna kill my wife. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good. So, but you and your husband, you were able to register. I mean, you both have the app. Not. Just, yeah, but he transferred me the, the funds. Oh, of so course. I have the money. I have yeah, the money. I have the money. <laughs> I have the money here. <laughs> that's good. Okay. Hey, that's a good question to start. Who handles the money in your house? Who manages the finances in your house? 
<laughs> oh no, teacher, you don't want to go there. You don't want to go there, teacher. No, no, no. <laughs> my wife is close. <laughs> okay. Not really. In my case, uh, since I got married, ever since I got married, I just gave her everything. You know, we both, we are both, uh, we have a, uh, we have studies on administration. Okay, we studied administration, both of us. But she does the cash flow every month, and every month we sit. Well, actually, every every other week, every other week we sit and we check the expenses, you know, and we project what we're gonna do, going to the supermarket, if the kids need shoes, uh, if the kids need um, clothes, whatever they need, you know, or we need. What about you? How do you manage your finances? <laughs> and he's like, damn it. <laughs> uh-huh. Talk to me. Okay. <clears throat> hey. It's a big question. It's a big question. Yeah. It's a big question. In my case, I do it. How far? And then we have Alexander. Go ahead. In my case, I do it, uh, the administration of the money in my house. And I use an app, I, I register all my expenses and, and earns. And I, when, when the app is, is color red, I know that I, I, don't, I don't spend. I don't have to spend more money, so I have to, to that, our app to save money. Hey, send, yeah, because, send the app. You have app. Send, yeah, the, send you the have the link. Yeah. The, the app is, is, is named oh. Monify. Monify on, on Play Store and App Store. Monify. Send, send I think the... that would be very useful. Yeah, it's not for free. <laughs> but yes, uh, the, there are uh, uh, an, uh, two applications. One for free and one uh, for pay. Okay, one is a paid app and the other one is a free app. See, I, I have the pay app, but it's, it's, a, it's cracked. Uh, it's cracked? Yes. Really? Yes, I, first I have to install Aptoide and then I, I can download that application in Aptoide and, and it is the, the full app. With... Well, I, I think we have the confidence by this at this point, Fernando, I think all of your classmates and I speak in behalf, I speak in behalf of all of your classmates when I say send a PowerPoint presentation to the group explaining how to crack the paid <laughs> version. <laughs> okay. That will be, okay. that will be good. Uh, the, the, the free app, uh, you you can create categories and you you can uh, synchronize your information with your account of Google or Dropbox. But mm. I, I have the, the full app. I, I synchronize my my information with uh, Google with Google Drive. And when I, if I lost my phone or I broke my phone, I can re re uh, recover that information. Recover the information. Can two people? work on the same database so if, if my wife and i want to report expenses to the that no no it's just personal no yes but you can uh, 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 download the app for the any end device what do you what do you want so you can synchronize if, if i use uh, some days i use an, uh, a phone and and, uh, and after i use other phone, so, you yes. can synchronize your, your information. You are away. up to date. Awesome. Send the link. <laughs> no, really, okay. send the link to the group. Okay. So we can all have that option. That's a great idea, actually. It's very important. What do you say, Alexander? I just, I just want to 
say that sometimes uh, you need to create your own balance, your budget before spending money and when you receive your your payment. Mm -hmm. your, yeah, your payment. That's uh, right. Because sometimes you have to save for money like a, like a backup because sometimes you don't know um, when you are going to get a, an emergency. When you're gonna, when you're gonna have an, ex an emergency, when you're gonna have an emergency, when an emergency is going to show up. Hey, good. Okay. So, is that a good conversation topic? <laughs> no. Okay. I want yeah. you. Yeah. I, I know. I have something different, guys. I want to test you today. Um, Okay, tell me about your background. I wanna hear about your background. Tell me about your background. That's gonna be the first question. And the second one, um, what are your future expectations? What do you expect from life? I'll tell you why in a minute. Before we move on, we must do this again. Give me one second. Where are you? There you are. Tomorrow is our last class. I hope you're doing your exercises on the platform. Tomorrow, tonight and tomorrow night, I'm going to work on it. Ada Azucena Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Thank you. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martinez. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. You listen to me? Yeah, I heard you. Okay. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chavez. Was Johnny here? Present. Okay, good. Um, Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernandez. Present. Excellent. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdez. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero, present. William Alexander Rivas Abarca, I'm sorry, William Alexander Rivas Flores, Ramirez Flores, yeah, present. Who's a, oh, I was reading, you see my eyes, oh my God, Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca, present. Thank you, Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde, present. Enrina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Okay, I think she's not here yet. No. Okay. Good. Hey, we're almost complete here. So, why am I making these two questions? These are interview questions that newcomers, newcomers or new hires, um, are not able to answer in. For me, I think those are very simple questions. Tell me about your background. Okay, um, I worked, I've worked in call centers for 12 years, multiple call centers. And um, I've also, well, 16 years actually. Um, I've also have worked as a teacher for seven years. Um, during this time I have started um, I have taken multiple certifications, you know, with different organizations. Um, I'm always learning and that's me. That's basically my, my background. I've also worked as an administrator, running payrolls, um, accounting, you name it. <laughs> but I started from the bottom, you know, I started cleaning floors, cleaning bathrooms, cleaning um, theaters movie theaters. I worked at the movie theater company. Okay, that's my background. What are your future expectations? Well, 
What I expect from the future, pay attention. What I expect from the future is wellness. You know, I have a lot of plans in my mind. I'm developing my own English course. Um, I'm developing myself as well. And something very important in my future is to be healthy. To be healthy um, because, of course, I have to work to provide food for my family. But uh, mainly, I want to be healthy to see my children grow. To see my children grow in the future. Um, that's why I want to be in good health. Therefore, therefore, I'm preparing myself. I'm exercising every day. I'm eating healthy. You know, I'm doing a lot of sacrifices to be healthy. Those are my future expectations. What about you? Créanlo, ¿no? Esto se ha vuelto un problema para muchos jóvenes. Yo estoy ahorita, estoy contratando gente, bueno, refiriendo gente al call center en el que trabajo, pero conozco gente que, que los puede agarrar. Sin embargo, no refiero gente que no hable bien. Y estas dos preguntas son las únicas que les estoy haciendo ahorita. Y los bichos se quedan en las nubes. Están en un nivel intermedio avanzado y... Uh -uh. So sorry. Da lástima, les digo, porque hay jóvenes que pues son padres primerizos, son padres muy jóvenes y trabajan en lo que hay, ¿no? Algunos de bartender ahí, como pueden, van saliendo y da cosas, pues, que están estudiando con becas y todo, pero no han logrado ese nivel que se necesita y necesitan un montón de gente. Hay un call center que está pagando 1.200 dólares por tres meses como bono de bienvenida. Imagínate, viene Navidad, ¿tú qué tal? Right. Eh, otros están pagando 800 dólares como el lugar en el que estoy, solo porque quedes contratado, el primer mes te pagan 400 dólares aparte de tu salario, y el segundo mes te pagan otros 400 dólares. ¿Cómo te sonaría a ti eso? Viene Navidad. Wait, ok. Mr. Poole, I'm gonna get the job. <laughs> I, was, I was thinking about you actually, but yeah. We have to talk about it. We need to develop a little bit more fluency and confidence. Confidence, you know, just say what you think. It's as simple as that. Okay, so let's practice some with these two questions. Come on, you can do it. It's very simple. Okay, let's go in small groups. Miriam, let's go. I I got I graduated um I I look I no, no I find another job and I start started started in uh, no I started work uh, about started the about my career and then uh, I had a I I have a son and for this moment I work in Lanco in the in the areas area accounting accounting area excellent the accounting area uh -huh. mm -hmm. and you Alexander, what about you?
no está. O Sandra. What about your background? Background. Jose, we cannot see your face. There you go. <laughs> Good. Okay, guys, remember this is simple past. Simple past. Talk about your background, your work experience, okay? Okay. Come on. Okay. Okay. I, I started to learn English. Um, and after that, I moved to, to work at Sykes. I have been working there for years and um, four months. My background. And what about you? Well, in my case, um, I was I was um internship and the administrative area area uh, first area area area, area. Uh, first um uh then i was an internship in the human human resource uh for a year uh um human resource with both the administrative area later i was working in a um, workshop in the administrative and sales area in and for for another year and in a bookstore too and then and now I'm working on administrative and uh, like a management assistant in a transport company. Mm. What about you, William? Or Denny? William, you are your microphone. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was. Uh, um, I worked at Tepe Lab as a project supervisor assistant from 2014 to 2016. Then I moved to my current job. So I have been working since 2016 to now. Until now. Oh, until now. Huh? So it's missing Rene Alonso. Oh no, yeah. Rene Alonso. Rene Alonso is the, is the okay. singer. Alfonso. Yes. Okay. Okay, and I have and only work only worked there for three years, and after I moved to other company, but always in Audi, and that company I I had I had to the spend so and I was promoting to a supervisor for three years and after that I moved to the other company always in Naudi and that company I only checking the 
the document of the audit and how resolve all the, for example, expenses and the profit. And I had to evaluate how the other workers made uh, the job, how they made the work and how to comment all the translation. And I'm working in, in Audi. Almost the time I, I have work in Audi. It's boring. <laughs> Because only checking document and travel to other department, for example, Cincinnati, San Vicente, and to move is it's a little difficult travel by the traffic difficult nowadays. Difficult the traffic. Only that. Remember, you can say that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Okay, two more minutes. Okay. I I yeah. I start I start a start a internship in Informatica Mobile Salvador. That company I think right now it, it does um, operate. And uh, I I start la, ta, as a, a programmer, Android programmer, and I was I was there for team for ten months, and after that I I. Change my change my job to to another job on uh, twenty eighteen. I start a new position as a iOS developer in Grupo GD, and I I work as a outsourcing for Ironman for three and a half years, and this year I I I changed changed my, my job to, to another new and uh, new one new one and uh, right now I, I am in a company named Listazo. that company is a, it's a company uh, that the what is it the facilities are in the USA in the, and, the USA mm -hmm. USA and uh, we I, I am a iOS developer for for that company, that is my employee history. Employment <laughs> history. Background. Employment history. That's my background. Perfect. That's my background. Okay. Good job. Let's go. Okay. 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 Guys. What are other ways of saying at the present time? At this moment? Right now. Right now. Mm -hmm. Right away. Mm, that's like right away. Now, okay. just, just now. Just now, very good. Uh huh. In this moment, teacher. In this moment, at the moment, right now, at this time, very good. So, why am I saying this? Is because um, some of you are not finding the way to say. Uh, you, you you typically use currently, right? Currently, I'm working. Currently, um, okay, I'm doing this and that. So, just now. I'm working for a company. Right now, I'm working. Why do you have to use the present continuous? Because you're talking about the present time, right? At this time, I'm working. At the present time, I am working at... Okay. Nowadays. Nowadays, yeah. At this moment in time, it's very used to as well. 
at this moment in time, I'm working as an accountant and so on. Okay. One more thing. Try to variate. Don't use only all the time. Try to say just. I just worked there. I just spent two years working there. I just worked there for three years. Right. I only worked there. Eh. You can use just and only interchangeably. You can always change between just and only. Okie dokie. Let me see. Ada Azufena. Azucena. Azucena. Okay, what is the past of B? Nadita? Sorry, teacher. <laughs> Mrs. Cáceres, what is the past of B? El pasado de pi. Mm -hmm. mm. I don't remember, teacher. Okay. Mm, Johnny, Johnny Vladimir Porticio, what's the past of B? Was where? Was where? Ding, 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 ding. You got it. Was where? 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 Okay. So the past of B is was where? Okay. William. <clears throat> Became. Perfect. Became. Thank you. Fernando. Don't Google it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Be gone. Let me see your hands. Um, Let me see your hands. <laughs> hey, that's that's what the police say. That that's what police says in the, in the states. Hey, let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. Open up and. <laughs> uh huh. Fair, fair. What's the past? Begin. Begun. Begun. Very good. Begun. Began. Began. Okay. Carolina. Blow. Blue. Blue. I don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> Pronunciation. Blue. Blue. Uh. Like the color. Yeah. Blue. Okay. Blow blue. Blow blue. Okay. Break. Jocelyn. Broke. Good. Ada, you got it as well. Break. Broke. Okay. Ada. Wrong. Bring. Wrong. Alexander. Brought. 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 Bring, brought, brought. Okay. Next. Uh, Miguel Angel. Build. What? Bolt. Bolt. Mm, what do you think, Alan? Build. Built. 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 Yeah, Built. you got it, Yes, Alan. Built. Okay. Regular or irregular? Irregular. Regular. Okay. I'll stay with that. What about by Sandra Elizabeth? By. Bow. Excellent. Bow. Repeat. Bought. What? Bought. Bought. What? But. Bot. Bot. By bot. Like B O T, bot. Okay. The past of Ken. 
Uh, Jose Antonio, the past of Ken. Ken. Let me give you a clue. It is another model. La pista es que es otro modal. Ken. Okay. Cool, teacher. Excellent. Yes, good. Very good. Cool. Good. 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 Ken. Good. Cool. Cool. Okay. Rene Alfonso, catch. Catch. Yep. Eso dijo el teacher en su primera clase en inglés, dando su primera clase. Un alumno muy inteligente le dijo, teacher, what's the past of catch? Y el teacher dijo, catch it. Y el, y el alumno dijo, are you sure? Y el teacher dijo, yes, I'm sure. Next day, el teacher tuvo que decir, I'm so sorry. Yes, the past of catch is caught. 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 Ok, vamos a ver algo rápido. Bye. Bot. 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 B-O-T. Bot. 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 Catch. Cut. Cut. C-O-T. C-O-T. Pronunciation. Cut. You got it. Cut. Okay. Catch. Cut. I cut the ball. Cut. Cut. Very good. Juice. Was Antonio again. Sandra, come on. Carla? Chose. 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 Very good. Yes. Chose. Chose. So you have choose. 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 Chose. Be careful. Don't say shoes. Say choose. Choose. Okay. Así como Jesús. Choose. Okay. Very good. Okay. Elvin? Come, baby, come, baby, baby, come, come. Um, come. Hmm. Hmm. Uh -huh. Come. 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 Past. Came. Came. You got came. it. Came. came. And yes, yes, Elvin. Come, came, come. Come, came, come. Come is el pasado participio. Okay, next. Cost. René. I don't know. The same. Cost. Jocelyn, Alexander. Cost. Cost. It's the same? Yeah. Yes. Doesn't, yeah. doesn't change. It's irregular. Very good. Um, Cut. Same. Cut. Same. Same. Good, William. Yes. Irregular. Okay. Easy. Do, Rene. Uh, do? Did. 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 You got it. And what's the participle? Yeah. What is the past participle? Done. Done. There you go. Do, did, done. Do, did, done. Draw. 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 Yes. It's similar to, Caro? Blue. <laughs> blue, blue. Draw, Drew. What's the past participle of blow? Blown. Blown. And Blown. the past participle of draw? Drawn. 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 So draw, drew, drawn. So lo agregas una N al final. Drawn. Okay. Drink, William. Your Drown. favorite, your favorite. Drink. <laughs> drunk. Drunk. No, really? Drunk. Drink? Drink. Drunk. 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 Uh -huh. Very good. Drink, drunk, drunk. You got it? Drive. Jose Antonio, drive. Draw. 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 Yes, drove. Very good. Past participle? Driving. Driving. Driving, Driving or dream? driven? Driven. 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 I've never driven a car. Okay, good. Eat easy. Alan. 
Eat it. Eat it. Oh, that's Ooh, a eight. participle. Eight. 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 Okay. Es que está en intermedio. Teacher, solo el pas pares. Okay. Okay. Fall. Excellent. Good job. Feed. Carla. Feed. What's the meaning of feed? Alimentar. 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 Perfect. Fed. 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 What is the past participle? Fed. 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 Same. It's the same. Okay. <laughs> okay. I was doubting. Feel. <laughs> Fernando, feel. Uh, felt? Yes, totally. Felt. Past participle? Felt. 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 You got it. Find. Sandra, find. Sandrita. Uh, your microphone. Yes. Found. Find. Found. Be careful. Found. Tengan cuidado con esta palabra. Si le quitan la O, quiere decir Found. otra cosa. Ok. Quiere decir fondos. Ok. Just be careful. Puede ser Found. muy confusa. Found. Find. Found. Pass participle. Found. Found to. Wow. Fly, William. Fly, flew. Okay, pass participle, Carolina. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Do it. Wow. <laughs> fly, fly, flew. Flown. Yes. Blow. Same thing. So we have blow, blue, blown. What was the other one? Flow. Oh, dry. Uh, I mean, draw, drew, drone, fly, flew, flew. Okay. Buy, 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 but, but. No, but similares. Similares tenemos blow, blue, blow. Blue, blown. 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 Okay. Draw, drew, drone. Y la siguiente, la otra. Fly, flew, flown. Forget, forgot. What? Forgotten. 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 Very good. Forgotten. Get. Got. Got. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Very good. Forget. Same thing. Oh, I'm sorry. Here it comes. Okay. Get. Got. Got. Got it. Got it. Okay. Got Give. Him. Give. Sandra. Give. Give. Excellent, Sandra. Thank yes, you. gave. Past participle? Given. Given. Okay, easy. Jose Antonio, go. Get. Uh huh, went. Okay, go, went. Past participle? Gone. 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 Good. Elvin, grow. Ooh. Excellent. Good. Yes. Grew. What's the past participle? Muy similar. Carolina, what's the past participle? Grown. <laughs> yes, you got it. <laughs> Grow, grew, grown. No. Okay. Let's see. Have, Carla? Have. Excellent. Past participle? Uh, have, 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 same have. thing. Yeah, have had had. Very good. Have had had. Here. <gasps> what is the pass of here, Miguel? Okay, Miriam. Yeah. Heard. Heard. You got it. Heard. Just add the D. Hit. Everybody hit. hit. Okay, hit, hit. Yes, you got it. 
Just one more. Hold. Held. 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 Very good. Past participle? Held. Same thing. Okay, as you can see, there are 88 verbs with their past in this uh, Quizlet presentation. So I'll send it to you right now. Make sure you practice. Okay, retense ustedes mismos haciendo ese ejercicio. Darle vuelta a la carta hasta que esté seguro de lo que vas a decir, okay? And try to look for the past participle of the verb too. Okay. Let's move it. I like to move it, move it. I'm hyper. I'm tired. I'm extremely tired, but I'm hyper. That's good. Okay, so today we have to talk about risk plans again. So what's the objective of this class, um, Alan? I would be able to. Uh, to identify key information in a passage about fire escape plan. About a, about a fire escape plan. About a fire escape one. Good. Key information. Uh, to identify key information in a passage. Good job. About a fire escape plan. About a, about a, about a. Acuérdense que la T entre dos vocales. Okay. About a. So, is there an emergency plan at your workplace? This is very important. Do you have an emergency plan at your workplace? What happens if some mareros get inside your workplace? Oh my God. Money. Shoot him. Good, sir. What? Hands up. Hands up. <laughs> okay. To the ground. To the ground. Okay. That's the escape plan. <laughs> okay. Not really. Uh, you know, that happened. Eso pasó en el 2006. Una, un call center que estaba. Entró la policía a traer a uno de mis compañeros que había sido deportado. Son 10 policías a traerlo en el piso. Fue algo exagerado, pero. They were like, what? Ok. So, is there an emergency plan at your workplace? Is there? Now, we kind of have emergency plans in El Salvador, but what's the most common natural disaster in El Salvador? Earth, earthquake. earthquake. Earthquakes. Okay, yeah, earthquakes are the most common risk, let's say, in El Salvador, right? But nowadays, nowadays, ever since Nayib is on, uh, on the presidency, you know, he's a president, fires in mercados are very common. Have you noticed? Suspicious. Suspicious. Activity. That's really <laughs> weird. I mean, who is who is doing that? Because El Mercado San Miguelito got on fire today. I was mm -hmm. in shock. I was like, what? But it was a huge fire. I mean, I thought it was a small fire, but it was a big fire. So what do you think? Do you think these people had had an emergency plan? Hmm, not actually. Okay. They only, they only were running away from the fire. They were just, I said, not yeah. only, just. Just. They, uh -huh, they were just, they were just running away from the fire, from the flames. Okay, really? I didn't see the whole news. Okay. So, guys, really, is there a, an emergency plan at your workplace? Do you really have an emergency plan in your office, Ada? Yes, teacher. Okay. It's, a, it's a frequently the training and the an accident for the um, temblores. Oh, due, due, to, due to earthquakes? Earthquakes, yes, it's the, it's the training for the... Um, Cómo lo explico eh, para para desalojar pues porque como con todos los pacientes ahí 
Hay que buscar okay. evacuación. To it's evacuate. In front of the, to evacuate. And the fires también is frequently. And the... Okay, yo, nunca visto, uh -huh, mm -hmm. yo nunca he visto un incendio, pero it's frequently the, the training the bomberos. Okay. For, for... Fire department. And, yes. It's, it's, okay. a, it's a... Um, is the training a periodic? Was, per, periodics is a cada three meses. At, every, every, every three every, months. Every three months. Every three months, uh, we are trained on um, how to. Yes. But okay, have you been informed about what to do in the yes. case of a fire? What do you do? What do you have to do? Um, and the the caution, the caution, the bomberos is the proportional um, manual um, <laughs> for <a little. laughs> to read I am the, Yes, I am quizzes in, in the in the class. I the um, se hace también talleres talleres. Um, workshops. Workshops in the workplace and the other people. Depende okay. are de, de entrenamiento. Depende del grupo que se va a entrenar. Depends on the group that will be mm -hmm. trained. Okay. Yes. Okay. In case of fire, it's a good idea to, okay, base verb. In case of fire, it's a good idea to run away, to keep calm, to, go out of the building or out of the office. Okay, it's necessary. Okay, you can use gerund as well. It's necessary to do what? To do this, this and that, okay. How else can I express this? In case of fire, it's a good it's idea. A fire, it's, it's a good idea. It's a good idea to apply your knowledge about your last training about it based based on the <laughs> and it's necessary to know how to extend or yeah or turn off extinguish 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 the fire um i'm not sure the fire is not a big fire when the fire starts. Excellent. Okay. So this, uh, what else can you say? You must you help. Must, you must help and keep calm mm -hmm. in order to help others. To help, correct. They say people in disability, uh, yeah, people with disabilities, you can help them as well if you can, if you can. Um, what else could we use? Oh, easy. Models, you should look for, you should look for, you should do this again. After this, you just need a base verb to continue talking. Okay, that's the whole idea. So let's practice these two questions. Let your classmates know if there is a risk plan, an emergency plan at your workplace. And if you have been informed about what to do in case of a fire, in case of an earthquake, because being honest in our country, there are no tsunamis. Okay. We are more in the risk of a volcano eruption, right? That could be Spain. more coming. Yeah, like Spain. Right now, everything is, every volcano is erupting. Chicos, traten de encender su cámara, porfa, en la medida de lo posible, okay? So I'm sending you that part to your chat. Let's talk about these two questions, okay? You can do it. Let's go.
In my workplace, um, when I, I, when I, the airplane, uh, first, uh, we have kit car, and we have push the hands and about the health and find a secure place, safe place. In fire, um, we don't have training. <laughs> In case of fire, we don't have training, but we have ex extin extinguish. If there is an emergency plan at your workplace, no, yes. there is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we we only got um, training about I don't know how to say primera auxilia. First aid, first aid. Yeah. Uh, first aid, and yeah, and we only have, for example, we just. Uh, let's, let's try to use just guys today. Not only forget about only today. Try to do it. Okay. Keep going. I don't know how to say extinguidores. Followers. Oh, extinguidores, extinguishers. Uh, Seguidores. Okay. Like, followers. <laughs> followers. <laughs> it's like, hey, que tiene que eso, right? <laughs> extinguishers. Uh -huh. We learn how to, how to use an extinguisher. Excellent. And and how to how to fix a, fix an accident for a, for example when some someone is hurt or something like that. Okay. Okay. What's the okay. difference? What's yeah. the difference between an injury and a and a I'm sorry, Yasmin. Uh, what's the difference between an injury and a wound? Mm, wound is is not. Yeah, it's like a. It's, how do you say? It? It's not strong than. There isn't blood or what? There isn't blood. Yeah, in a wound. Wound. Wound, yeah. Okay, what about an injury? Injury is more dangerous. It's more dangerous for, for your health. More complicated. More complicated. Okay, in gra grammatically, they are synonyms. Okay, injury and wound are mm. synonyms, but you're right. A wound is something that requires a longer treatment, a wound es una herida. Ambas quieren decir heridas, pero um, en el contexto, una wound, una herida, de ese, o tratar como wound, es algo que requiere tratamiento, okay? que no vas a curar de la noche a la mañana. Una injury, una herida eh, de ese tipo, injury, puede ser algo que solo vas a solucionar cosiendo y estuvo. Okay. Sorry, I have a commercial right now. Okay, keep going, keep going. Okay, thank you. Okay. What about you, Alexander? I told you before. No, you didn't. 
Yeah, where was the question? Uh, what, what's the company? No. Sorry? Your company. What's the, your company? Uh, in the, the company I work is in a logistic company. What's your company uh, about? What's your company about? Your company about? Uh, they move uh, whole grains for uh, different uh, uh, companies. For example, uh, I'm not sure if I could say brands here, teacher. In five seconds, you will. <laughs> okay. Bye. And not all for hours, not the plan. You you only know that the plan exists, but but you don't know what what you have to do. I'm I'm right. Am I right? Sorry. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? <laughs> Sorry. No, it's okay. I think that 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 we know the the that the plan exists, but we don't know. We well, don't know what to do. do. I think that, yeah, I think that the, uh, since we're working from, from home or since some company um, has, yeah, some company, some company has. Um, mm, some companies have. I don't know how to say. Some companies, oh, ah, yeah, yeah, some companies have, so I can say the majority of the, the majority, the majority of their employees working at home. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that that they are not um, they are not um, they are not trying to to they are not good Isela. They are not concerned about creating awareness in the employees. I got your point. Okay. Yeah. They are not concerned about creating awareness in their employees. Yeah, about, because about uh -huh. mm -hmm. I think that if if you go to the some floor. You will see that the, the, that equipment is not is not in in a good um shape. Like, Hold on, shape. In, in good position. Uh, yeah, in good position, and also in a good um. I don't know how how I can say that, but in an appropriate. Um, it seems that that they that, that they have they have not um make man, maintenance on the on the equipment. So and, and it's because uh, we are not working uh, at uh, at the office. At site, I think. Yeah. Yeah. True. Well, that doesn't apply for some of us. You know, I'm very tidy. I'm very organized. And <laughs> since since we're living in Salvador, I think that that once uh, an earthquake starts, they always say, "Please calm down, calm down, <laughs> calm down." And 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 then you have to wait around three um, earthquakes or, or more. No no no. Uh, I think that that sometimes they uh, wait for for a really hard strong a strong earthquake to evacuate the the personnel because I remember that that some I think that some years ago we. Uh, I was working and I was taking calls and I remember that that I think that were around three earthquakes on the same afternoon. Three earthquakes, three earthquakes, I'm sorry, three earthquakes in a row. Three, three earthquakes in a row. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, and then I remember that at first, um, they only said, um, please wait, we uh, hold on. Wait, in esta clase no vamos a decir only, not anymore. <laughs> okay, we Sorry. just, try to say we just, not we only. Okay, okay. 
with jobs. I, I, I forgot what we are going to say, but, <laughs> but I, I remember know. that that I start, I start raining, and at the end, we we went we went out. Yeah, we went out. We went out at the third um, earthquake, and it was raining. So sometimes they they ask to to wait as a awesome. third uh, step. Yeah. Awesome. You know what? Uh, back in I don't know what year was it, 2007, I think there was an earthquake um, in the call center that I was working for. And one of the um, employees that was in charge of calming, you know, that that just said, you know, okay, calm down, calm down, cal calming down everybody. She was running to the exit and yelling, calm down, calm down. And she was running, calm down guys, relax, don't run. I was like, what? And the worst thing that could happen, I, I was taking a call. I was taking a call and I didn't move. <laughs> Everybody went out of the building. The same, the same <laughs> was, happened to me. I was in a call. And then my boss said, I was, why didn't you go out? I was connected. I was connected with the, with the customer and I was under the, the spot. And and I remember that I that I said to the customer that that um, I, I said I'm sorry um, we have an earthquake and she started to say oh my god really and where where do you what is the question what what is the correct way where where, are where you? do you are what are you where are you yeah where are you and and I said in El Salvador and he started to he started to she started to pray to pray yeah <laughs> and she was saying oh uh, please save all the agents please god and and i was uh, yeah we will continue praying but i um, have to disconnect the call and at the end i, I disconnect her the call oh my god yeah that happens yeah that happens hey we have to go back it's 9 8 p.m we have to do the attendance okay great job Okie dokie, before we continue, we must do the attendance again. <clears throat> We're all back. Okay. Ada Susena Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Carolina Yvette Romero Avelino. I'm here. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martinez. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Present. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. Excelente. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Roberto Luis Umaña Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Enrina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Thank you. A ver, vamos a ver. Um, el listado que yo tengo a este punto ya tiene calculado el porcentaje de asistencia, chicos. Este Johnny no se puede perder la clase de mañana tampoco. No puede desconectarse ni un minuto ahorita. Um, Carol, o sea, todos pues no pueden perderse la clase de mañana pero críticos si sí serían Johnny, René René tiene que estar mañana en la clase también porfa oh, eh, yeah, yeah, eh, Reina Reina Marisabel también please Hi. 
Sí, y, y Sela, fíjate que... Yes. Yes, yes, you have to be yeah, here. Yeah, I was too full today. Awesome, awesome. Sí, pero yo creo que si no faltas ni un minuto ahorita y mañana ya estamos bien. Ok, very important. I will be the next class on, uh, I like, um, oyentes. Oh, really? Ok. Yeah, for that reason. It's ok. It's ok, don't Thank worry. Thank you, teacher. It's my punishment. Thank you. Yeah, and don't me. worry. <laughs> <laughs> ok, don't worry. No, pero si está, estamos bien, o sea, al final todos vamos a seguir, espero yo, ¿verdad? Nadie ha pensado en renunciar de este asunto. Very good. No tienen la toalla, chicos. Nunca, nunca. Ok. So, let's make out of this reading, if you noticed, there is a, an article, they call it differently here, an excerpt, there's an excerpt about a fire escape plan. Um, I was listening to Isela telling a story. I remember something happened to me when I was working at a call center and there was an earthquake I'm sure you all have stories to tell about earthquakes, right? My God, we lost a dog in the family on the earthquake from 1986. I was four years old, but we lost a dog. That's what they say. I still remember that dog some, somehow. So did you, did you what, uh, or did you see what happened on, on Mexico that the, the tune and er, the an earthquake or I don't know it was it was caused by by the rain but some dogs died due to due to the, the house. The worst, there um, were there were a lot of flutings. Oh yeah yeah Flutings. yeah it was rain. Flutings. Yeah there's a lot of water everywhere. I don't know man. The, the world the world is changing the world is changing a lot and it was about time it was about time for all these all of these natural not nature catastrophes to start occurring don't you think so it is what it is let's continue let's see so your job is not just to read you have to read okay but identify words identify words that you don't understand so practice escaping from every room in the building practice escape plans every month best plans have two ways to get out of each room if the primary way is blocked i don't like the word way do you see how they are using the word way here if the primary way is blocked what do you understand by that? Can somebody translate this sentence for me? If the primary like a, way is blocked? Like a, like a path. Uh-huh. Yeah. The primary path. It's the a primary, primary way. That doesn't path. sound right. The primary path exit? Way. Maybe exit? Mm. Yeah. Sounds, sounds better. It's blocked by fire or smoke. You will need a second way out. That makes sense. A second way out. Okay, like a window onto an adjacent roof. Adjacent. Hmm. Also, practice filling your way. Practice filling your way out of the building in the dark or with your eyes closed. Hmm. Hmm. Is this all right? Also, practice feeling your way hmm, out of the building in the dark or with your eyes closed. Oh, yes. Feeling, right? Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Your sense. <laughs> yeah, that for me was crazy. I mean, also practice feeling your way out of the building in the dark or with your eyes closed. Okay, and so on. Try to find words that you don't know and explain the words to your classmates after the reading. For example, adjacent. Maybe next to. 
You know, yeah. it's like something is next to something else. Okay. And so on. Good. Give an example, if you can, please, about the paragraph that you read. Give an example about the paragraph that you read uh, in your own words. Try to understand this on your own words, okay? I will make you questions about each point. We have one, two, three, four, five bullet points, five bullet points to discuss with your classmates, okay? Okay. Okay. That's page 40, last page of your book. Teacher, nos acabamos el libro. ¿Qué vamos a hacer mañana? You will see. Just talk. Just talk. talk, 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 talk. No, no, no. We have to practice for our final exam. Y recordando sobre eso, por favor, no vayan a hacer la encuesta de satisfacción. Okay, mañana la vamos a hacer todos juntos. Okay, let's go. Page 40. It's in the picture right now. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, you guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, someone can share the, the paragraph, page 40? Yeah. Okay, thank you, Alvin. Oh. Ah, the teacher said it already. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yes. <coughs> Sorry. Bless you. Bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Can we leave one share the person, please? One paragraph. One paragraph each. I'm going to start. Practice, practice escaping from every room in the building. Practice escape plans every month. The best plans have two ways to get to get out of each room. If the primary weight is blocked by fire or smoke. You will need a second way out, mm -hmm. like a window onto an adjunct roof. Also, mm -hmm. practice mm -hmm. getting your weight out, getting your weight out of the building in the dark or with your eyes closed. No. Okay, I will continue. Immediately leave the place. When a fight occurs, do not waste any time saving goods. Take the safest exit route, but it should most escape through a smoke. Remember to crawl out, teacher, under the smoke and keep your mouth covered. The smoke contains toxic gas which can dis disorient, disorient you or at worst overcome you. Crawl low. Take the safest exit route. But if you okay. must escape through smoke, remember to crawl, crawl low, crawl low. Crawl low. That's what babies do. I know the meaning mm. because because I love the the air supply sound. The air supply long the song? Song, yeah. Which one? There is a part that do you really wanna see me crawl? 
Oh, okay, crawl. Uh -huh. But low is like soldiers. Soldiers on war, during war, they used to crawl low. It's basically like crawling with your chest, right? Oh, yeah. Uh-huh, that's weird. It's, it's the same, but, but, it's, but it's like nearly off the, off the floor. Because of the smoke. Okay. Was that your question, Jocelyn? Yes. Thank you. Which I think that describe? was about the pronunciation, but crawl, crawl low, crawl low, crawl low, crawl low, crawl low. Yep. Keep it up. Never. The smoke alarm batteries need to be tested every month and changed with new ones at least less once a, a year. Once a at year. least once a year. At least once a year. Okay. Okay. And now, little guy. You did it already? Okay. Sorry? Okay, you, you're you done reading? Are you done reading? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Did you understand every word? No. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm very happy. Okay. Oh my <laughs> okay. And... Okay, try to read and understand. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. Practice escaping from every room in the building. Practice escape plans every month. Every month. Huh? The best plans have two ways to get out of each room. If the primary way is blocked by fire or smoke, you will need the second way out like a window on onto an adjacent roof. Adjacent roof. What is it? Onto an adjacent <laughs> roof. Roof. Uh, It's near, it's near a... Uh... No, techo. Okay. Roof, roof is techo, right? What um, is adjacent? Adjacent? <laughs> <laughs> the same as in Spanish, but what is the meaning yeah. of adja adjacente? Uh, so next to uh huh. Yeah. It it have a, a, a exit escape escape exit. It's similar. Uh -huh. mm. An exit. An emergency exit. An emergency, emergency exit. exit. Yeah. Okay. Also, practice feeling feeling your way out of the building in the dark or with your eyes closed. Okay. Okay. Try to understand. 
<laughs> what? Oh, my. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Come on, guys. Just kidding. <laughs> Hey teacher, in this case, uh, we are uh, struggling about the topic. Is all this excerpt or only uh, the for, whole for group? whole thing? The whole, the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. Try okay. to find new vocabulary. Understand Dark. each part. In this case, it did work. Dark knob with figure out is like a, a handle of the door. Door knob. Yeah, the doorknob. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the yeah. Doorknob. Correct. The crack between the do crack between the door. Crack between the door. What's crack in this case? Crack between the door. In my previous job, I remember uh, when uh, when the when the when the core are uh, earthquake something like that. ¿Cómo se diría un temblor? Un earthquake. Earthquake. Lo mismo. Earthquake. Lo mismo. Uh, and we, you can also say tremor. We have we have to to meet in the garden, no sé, jardín, of the of the house. Uh, uh, the the office uh, was a well there is a house the big house so uh, we have to to meet at the garden in the garden when uh an earthquake occurred when when an when an earthquake occurred when occurs. an earthquake occur, okay. occurs of course of course yeah when there's a tremor when there's trembling when there's a quake when there's an earthquake when there's a shiver when there's a shake. We had a, a emergency co committee. As it says, committee. 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 And that was confirmed by uh, one person only. <laughs> was composed by one That's person. Composed. Ah, was composed. You can use seismic. Seismic? Seismic. seismic. Uh -uh. It's warm. Yeah. Earthquake. Just together. Yes. Committee. 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 Dry away from sidewalk. Any other word? Fire fires. Fire fires. Ah, es como el extintor. No, it's oh, the people. No. Ah, the people who works. Ah, fire fire. Okay. Uh huh. At the fire department. <laughs> it's ironic. <laughs> Firefighters. Yeah. yeah. Combatientes de fuego. Right. Bomber. Uh, so, so, so. Crowd low. Crowd low. Uh, I is like, uh, I, I mentioned before, it's like, it's like a baby. It's oh, like a on the, crawl, on the it's gatear. Crawl, crawl low, crawl, crawl low. low, gatear. Yeah. Mm. Under the smock and keep your mouth covered. At the back of your, uh, the back of your poster demand. Para uh, and to feel the top of the door, de la parte superior de la puerta. Uh, uh, bueno, I think 
de, bueno, lo que entiendo es que, que no hay que, como que no hay que agarrar la manecilla de la puerta cuando esté caliente. Eso creo que es lo que entiendo. Uh -huh. Y usar una puerta de emergencia que es como que es la de evacuación. Correcto. Okay. Uh -huh. Emergency yeah. exit. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Eso lo, uh -huh. en, el, en el de párrafo, en el, en el tercer párrafo. Uh -huh. The third paragraph. Ah, third, the third paragraph. Third. Okay. Third. The third paragraph. Third paragraph. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Next. Mm -hmm. Oh. Um, Sign name. How do you say that word? Uh, Designing. Designing a meeting place outside and take attendance. Designing a meeting location away from the building, for example, meet under a specific tree or at the end of the driveway or from sidewalk to make sure everyone has gotten out safely and no one will be hurt looking for someone who is already safe uh, away from the whole thing is in a meeting location away from the view for example of the driveway. Yeah. Like under the tree, under a tree, or the same meeting location on the lejos del edificio the Uh, Make sure everyone has got an out safely and no one will be hurt. Uh -huh. Looking for something to get safe. <clears throat> what is the right way? Uh huh. I don't know. Like the road. Meet on the road. Ah, like the street, maybe in Spain. Ding, 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 ding. No? Yeah. <laughs> okay. La calle, pues. Mm -hmm. Miguel, te iba a decir otra vez. And sidewalk is like when you, when the people walk. Okay. One south, stay out. No. Okay. Mm -hmm. Outside and pay attendance. Outside. Es como recibir a y dar asistencia a designar en un. Juan Sal, que sea, no, una vez afuera, que no. afuera. ¿sí? Ah, recuerda salir que. 
Fred, you have to exit. Recuerda escapar primero. Never go back into a burning building for any reason. If someone is missing, tell the firefighters. They are equipped to perform rescue safely. Rescue. Mm -hmm. Finally, having working smoke alarms installed on every level, every level dramatically increases your chances of survival. Smoke alarm daily need to be tasted every month and change with 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 once at least once a year. Excellent. I know have been working. I've been working. Okay, I need a volunteer. I need a volunteer to explain to me what is practice escaping from every room in the building. In your own words, you just need to explain to the class, what is it referring to the first paragraph of this excerpt? Practice escaping from every room in the building. Find different way it out. Way out. Find different ways out. Find different ways out. Okay. How often? Okay. I don't remember. You don't remember, come on, guys. At least, at least once a year. Practice cake plans every month. Every, every month. month. But what do you understand? I mean, so they're referring to a building, maybe? Or just your office? How many exits do you have in your office, in your job? Carla? How many doors, windows? That Think, think about your office right now. How many windows or doors do you have to escape? Windows uh, for escape. One, one door. One Just the window. window. Just the door. Just, yeah. Just. Because it's the second floor. It's the second floor. Yeah. And there's no window that... Windows, know, yeah. But if, 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 we, if we jump... Mm -hmm is uh, we can we could die oh yeah <laughs> we could die hey but what's better to break a leg or to break be leg. to be to get burned break a leg, break a leg. <laughs> you, have to, you, you are gonna be lucky you're gonna be lucky lucky if you, you <laughs> lucky. just break if you just break a leg you will be lucky um yeah is are there ways to jump off a second or fourth roof without killing yourself can you jump no can you uh, like a, uh, a cat <laughs> yeah like, like can you slide <laughs> Can you slide on the wall, you know, like little by little? <laughs> yeah. With your nails. With your nails, with your teeth, with everything. I mean, it's your life. I'm just thinking about September 11, all these people on the buildings, they were jumping out of the buildings. That was crazy. Okay. That, that was really bad. Okay. Uh, how about your house, Fernando? We are in the office, right? I'm in the office right now. <laughs> there's no door. I mean, there's just the door to yeah. the living room. In my case, I, I am in a, in a room that 
I use only for work or for play. <laughs> Plain. That is Plain. Uh -huh. so, play. so uh, the, the, this, the, the, there is a window and I have only one exit in my house. Excellent. Hey, I forgot. There is a window. Uh, hold on. There is just a window yeah. that leads to, where does that lead? To the street? No, to, to the uh, roof. Backyard. Backyard. Ah. Oh, to the garage. 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 To the garage. Oh. Wait, to the garage or to the roof of the garage? To the garage. <laughs> Oh, it's all your turn. <laughs> I don't remember. Sí, es que... sí, <laughs> recuerdo, pero... yeah. But the window has a, a like a fence. <laughs> oh, there's a fence. Yeah, there's a fence in my house too. There's a window and then you have the garage, but the, the, the window has a fence. Okay. Wow. Very good. What about you, Jocelyn? Well, me. Do you have any escape well, plan? in my case, no teacher, <laughs> just one, there is one exit route that is lead to the living room. Okay, there is just one exit that leads to the living room. Yeah, the same as me, the same thing. It's just our houses are not designed for earthquakes and fires, I think. No. 2007 2007 it's nine o'clock it's 9 p.m and i'm on bed i'm on the bed with my kids watching videos watching a tale to go to sleep we're watching a tale and then a 7.1 earthquake do you remember 7.1 earthquake on 2007 or 2009 i can remember guess what I just closed my eyes, I opened my eyes, and I was, I was in the street. I was on the street, and my kids and my wife were behind me, like, uh-huh, she got me, yes. <laughs> like, oh, oh, sorry, I, I didn't, I, I didn't notice, I was just, I don't know how, but I got to the street, like, stop. I escaped. <laughs> Man. It's usual in the main. I don't know. It's normal. It's normal. No. <laughs> yes, <teacher. laughs> Oh, my God. <laughs> that happens with men. Okay. So let, let's go with the next point. Let's see. Um, immediately leave the place. Okay, who wants to go for the second part? Sorry. Uh huh. Immediately leave the place. Take a part of the fire on the building. Yeah. Stay away. And don't Stay waste. Away. Don't waste any time saving good. Did no waste any time saving goods. Okay, can anybody tell more about it about that? In this kind of issue, when there is a fire, I guess that they tell us that we cannot waste any time uh, to to bring out our stuff or things things like that. They, we must run away for our life because remember there is a fire. This increase over and over and over immediately. We can uh, wait for, for things or something. We must just run, run away. Good point, totally. But being honest, being human. Mm, yeah. Will you go back for your, what will you go back for? That this was a question on intermediate one in an academy. Imagine that there's an earthquake. Mm. Imagine that you are sinking, you are sinking in the ocean on a boat. 
on a big boat, on a cruise, what things will you save? What things will you save? Things, objects. That's it. Oh, huh. <laughs> of course. Okay. We're in the middle of the ocean. Let's go with this example. We're in the middle of the ocean. The cruise is cracked like Titanic and you're sinking. Okay, Alexander will go back for his cell phone. Jocelyn, what would you try to save? What object? Um, if it is a, an object, my cell phone, my computer. Okay. William, what would you save? My pet, maybe. Oh, come on, objects. <laughs> ah, <okay. laughs> <laughs> El perro te está escuchando a la parda. <laughs> okay. Be a trial, man. <laughs> I'm not an object. Uh -huh. My cell phone. The cell phone. Fernando, what would you say? An object. You're in the middle of the ocean. Ah, my, my MacBook. <laughs> your mac oh my god really you're so materialist i can't believe it carolina sandra what Obviously. would you say yeah. what objects would you say my glass <laughs> my phone my everybody and my wife. alan alan miguel carla make sense to this you're in the middle of the ocean i rested myself teacher i think it would say my PlayStation. Object oh, <laughs> PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, make logic. Alan. They, they, they are. Uh huh. Is it? They have all their their. How do you say pertenence? How do you say pertenence? Their belongings. Belongings. Their belongings. Uh -huh. Belongings. Their belongings. Yeah, because you are uh, traveling in a. Cruise. In a cruise. So I think that you only have some essential things. And okay. if you, you have an, a, a phone, if you try to save your phone and at the end you are thinking uh, maybe the phone is going to be useless. Is yeah, useless. Unless <laughs> the, the cell phone uh, is is a good one that, that can uh, that satellite and satellite connection because yeah, there's no signal in the if, middle of the ocean not, it, it, it doesn't work for you gps <laughs> yeah. oh come on yeah. gps yeah. gps doesn't work <laughs> nah. i think that, I, that i'm going to i'm going to save something to it because you cannot survive or oh yeah you can but but I think that it's better to have something to it. There's something that there is something that you can replace later. But the food is something that you won't find, find it in the ocean. No way. She's a what? What was the word before? Wait a minute. Let. What was the word? Remember? Let the. I don't remember, but that's why she's a supervisor. People, one plus, please. That's pure logic. You're in the middle of the ocean. There's no signal for your cell phone, food, uh, medicines, a boat, a, a, a floatable, you know, an inflat inflatable, inflatable boat, an inflatable boat. A, uh, knife, a rope. A rope. A vest. Clothes. Oh. You got it. It's and just cool. a but uh, everything is becomes useful if you don't can get uh, someone to help you. Right, but how can you make the cell phone work in the middle of the ocean? Can you call? I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. it's a miracle. <laughs> Come on, okay. <laughs> So immediately leave the place. Don't waste time, you know, saving your goods. Never open doors that are hot 
to the touch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, actually, in this topic, is you need to touch with your the back of your hand before open the door. No, the back of your hand before opening yeah, the back. Open the door. Before, uh, yeah, because if you open the door with a kick, if you are desperately, you can unleash the fire. Desperate. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah the fire in front of you and you are going to burn die, die. Die. yes i mean have you seen that when a building is on fire and the heat the heat gets pressurized like in an oven and you open a door boom everything explodes that's the reason because the 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 hot air the hot air is trying to escape from somewhere, very good. Now, I like this one, designate a meeting place outside and take attendance. <laughs> this is crazy. Designate a meeting place outside to take and take us attendance. Sandra, what do you think? Miguel, Elvin, you're so quiet, Elvin. In my case, teacher, this is a, a plant in my, in my work, in my company. That, that's part that's part mm -hmm. of the plan in my company yeah yeah uh, we we have to meet in the parking lot when pass any event when any anything like that happens yeah anything like that happens okay and what happened if someone is missing uh-huh do they take attendance miguel on the yeah. How yeah, do you say simulacros? How do you say simulacros? I said it before. Uh huh. Drills. Uh huh. On the emergency drills, so they do take attendance. Yeah, there there, there are people in charge for in take charge attendance. in charge for of, take attendance. Eh, in charge of taking attendance. Of take attendance. Yeah. Excellent. Okay, Elvin. I'm sure Elvin goes through these very often. A plant, a production plant. I mean, you must do what, Alexander? Emergency drills. You must do emergency drills in the plant, in a production plant, right, Elvin? Yeah, that's correct. Uh, um, there, there are, um, there are two, two drives, dr drills. Uh, and uh, uh, per year, per year, yeah, it's necessary. Uh, that the uh, do we do uh, a drill, and and the, the, there are uh, to 25 emergency doors because emergency doors 25. Yeah. Yeah, because the co the company is very big, there are three thousand employees. It's three thousand employees. Yeah. My God. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, Elvin, continue. What do you think about once out, stay out? In your own words. One out. Once out, stay out. Once out, stay out. One out. Once, una vez, afuera. Yeah. Once out, stay, yeah. stay out. Quédate afuera. And notify the department. <laughs> and notify the fire department, uh-huh. And Once tell the fire, fire the pickers, pickers, or bomberos. Mm -hmm. The fire department, yeah. Uh, fi firefighters, firefighters. 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 Okay, so everybody, Jocelyn, what do you think? What's once out, stay out? Um, you are out now, you already survived. You are already 
you're already safe. secure. So safe. you can uh, sorry. Safe. Uh -huh. You're already safe. You cannot. You're already safe. You cannot come back for for your for your belongings. You can just be there, and even you may lose something, you must forget. You must you forget about it. You that because you know advice. If a, if a son or relative is inside of the building, what do you do? Yeah, that's crazy. You will have to play Forrest Gump. Yeah. You will have to act up like Forrest Gump. Hey, did you check the list of, um, what was it, phrasal verbs that I sent you? Sort of. Sort of, right? I don't remember. Yeah, phrasal verbs. Okay, you have meanings, you have um, examples on that PDF, so check it. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Let me do the attendance one more time so you can rest in peace. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza, yeah? Wait, what? Present teacher. Wait, someone said wait. No? Okay. Okay. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Good night. Good night. Elvin Arcide Seguizabal Martinez. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Thank you. Todavía no se vayan, por favor, quedan dos minutos. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present teacher. Good. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Present. Carla Yanet Amaya Herrera. Present. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. Good. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. At home, at home already. Okay, Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. And Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Present. Thank you very much. Ok, eh, una de sus compañeras eh, pues ya no, ya no entendió la clase y le tocaba estar con nosotros el día de hoy. Mañana cierra Elvin o hoy le tocaba Claudia Marisela Solano Crespín, pero no está con nosotros. ¿Alguien se puede quedar 10 minutos más? Just to have a conversation for 10 minutes in English, of course. Ok, no volunteers. Okay, guys, I know you're tired. I'll see you tomorrow at 8 o'clock again. Please don't miss your class, por favor. La plataforma también, okay? See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Good night. Good night. Good night. Sir? Good night. William. Sorry, teacher. It's okay. <laughs> Good night. Good night. <laughs>